virtual universe. Uh, you might know this. This is that uh, Steven Spielberg movie, uh, Ready Player One. Introduce us to what virtual reality could be like in the year 2045. Well, you're practically already here. Here in 2018, we have Minecraft. It's kind of virtual reality in some ways. If you don't know a lot about Minecraft, it just happens to be the second best-selling standalone video game of all time, where you can build new worlds and the kids love it. And this weekend, Minefair rolls into town. The ultimate Minecraft experience is what they call it. So we've got some kiddos playing some Minecraft this morning. Sam here is going to get some shots of them kind of interacting on Minecraft. And so we want to talk. We've got Gabe and Brian here. I'll start with you, Gabe. Uh, what exactly is Minefair? I mean, is it kind of a festival of Minecraft? It is an amazing weekend festival where kids have the opportunity to bring their parents and introduce them to things that they love. Which in this case, is who these YouTubers are, yeah. uh, what they love about the game. And when these parents are at home, sometimes they're multitasking, doing a lot of other things. They don't get a chance to sit next to them side by side and see what's really happening in their brains. So, and Brian actually teaches kind of the background of Minecraft, how to program in Minecraft, how to build in Minecraft, all the mine, all that Minecraft is. It's different than a normal game. It's not Mario where I just kind of turn my brain off and play. It's more mm -hmm. interactive than that. Exactly. It's a sandbox game, which means you can build and create in anything. So at the Mindfair show, we have a learning lab area as one of the many exhibits. And we allow people to sit down and learn a, uh, a creative session on what to do in, in Minecraft. Yeah. So it just exposes people to all the great learning opportunities. Because that's my biggest problem. Is the first time I sat down and played Minecraft, my 10-year-old loves it, by the way, I, I said, w what am I supposed to do? Like, who are the bad guys? Who do I shoot? <laughs> He's like, doesn't work like that, Dad. <laughs> Although, stay away from the creepers. At night, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, exactly. So you've got some kids. These are your kids, right? Yes, they are. Playing some Minecraft over here. I want to ask you, bud, why do you like this game so much? I like playing in survival and mining and making houses. Nice. Survival's where you got to stay away from the creepers? Yeah, and all the other mobs. All the other ones. All the, what did he say? The mobs? Is the that mobs. what he said? <laughs> the mobs. Right. See? What do I know? I know nothing. All right, so, uh, Gabe, this weekend, where is it? What are the details on it? So we're at the Denver Mart this weekend, and what's really amazing is that you can come, um, bring your kids, and be the hero. Uh, it's a, we have tickets for, I believe they're 10 to 5. Oh, cool. um, I think we're really a couple of uh, VIP tickets left. Um, that being said, I, I know that when parents leave, they get a chance to really, really, you know, you know learn a lot about their kids, not only at the show, sure. and more about mine. Craft, but they get to guide their child after the event. Yeah, teach the parents. Because yeah, we right. should know a little bit about what these kids are doing. And I'm telling you, my kid is just obsessed like so many kids. Well, thanks, you guys, for coming out. Have a good show this weekend. Hey, thanks, guys. Nice job. Woo! You had to play Minecraft this morning. Really difficult, wasn't it? <laughs> like pulling teeth, let me tell you. Let's get to Sam. She's got a time saver traffic alert this morning. Sam, we'll start with you.